Boo -doo -doo -doo. All right, Donna, Donna, Donna. Donia Dega. Donna Dega. All right, Donna. Uh, first of all, this is coming out fantastic. Um, you are doing very, very well. Um, I'm trying to blow this up. So we're looking at your line drawing here. Uh, you have done the story, you've brought it through the line process, you've brought it through the spacing process, uh, so it's all locked into the grid. Um, each individual uh, character has their own energy. I love how when we're looking up at her, we have the sky, everything's coming to her, we stop, we appreciate her, we see her, she has her own energy, her own vibe. When we look at the little boy, he has his own energy, his own vibe. He brings us across through. Then this line comes down, giving us the energy and the vibe of this boy who ultimately comes from the dominant vertical. Um, and, uh, and this brings us back up into, uh, up into the image. Ultimately bringing us back to the little boy in the center, which we designed to... Uh, communicate the splash, the jump, the, the, the playful ruggedness of the little guy in, in the middle. Um, so this is where I want you to be now. So we're basic, so this is good. Um, you need to compose a little area uh, for your for your signature. okay? So find how you're going to do that. Uh, maybe you could use this point. If you still have the grid. The grid. Uh, that would have been a. Give me one second. Um, oh, it doesn't work if I. I'm using the eraser tool, so maybe you can come from this point down. Uh, we can probably come through here there and maybe this point here allowing us that little box to put your name in okay now obviously if that's too long then maybe we can come from this little section down all right so now you have a little nice little area to put your your signature in so the one thing I want you to do is go back through this drawing and passage your edges. Now, what does that mean? Um, passage means passage, okay? So in essence, it's this. If you have a line coming across, and let's say you have an object here, and you have an object in the back there, passage is when you dissolve the edge, the, the line that's, that's going behind the object. This way, we know which one's in front, which one's in the back, and what's happening is it's allowing this air to pass, pass by or pass through, okay? So what I, I, I went through and just did it on the computer real quick and, and um, you can see here how breaking this line, breaking the line where the, you can see how her arm comes and touches right there, this line comes here. We're gonna talk about that line because that's not a good line. Um, you can see how this curve comes and hits the, the back of the boy, these lines through all of this, okay? The lines down here on his leg, so what we're doing is basically allowing a, a little passage of air to, to, uh, to give almost like an aura um, around your objects, okay? So just go around them and make sure that the eye can breathe uh, around them, okay? Um, right up underneath our skirt, uh, his leg in here, breaking her, separating her from the background. See like the difference right here. And what's nice about here is when you break it up because it's all built on these diagonals, 
it, you can actually just passage it right into that same diagonal. Boom, boom. And it has a little structure. You can see how I did it on the boat here for you, up in here. So just go throughout the image and passage all your edges. Okay. The other, the last thing I want you to do is to be very careful about this um, line here. You see how your eye comes in and then it, it goes here? We don't want that, okay? So what I want you to do is get rid of this line and right there, now it works, okay? Now if you want to draw a line there and connect that line with this one here, okay? And that way, now our eye is looking up and over. Might even follow that through right there, okay? Boom, boom. Okay, and so now what's happening is now our eye is moving the way it ought to. Which is, remember the little boy's looking up and up and over. So that's that versus, see how these two little lines throw you off right now, right? You can feel it and you can see it. That's how it is now. Make the corrections, boom. Boom. So we gotta manage those little nuances. But, um, but overall, you did really, really great. So um, you can move on. Just make those little corrections then you can move on uh, to uh, experimenting with your value plan. Okay, don't worry about your, uh, not your value, but yeah, your value plan. Don't worry about your value study at this time. Just make sure you have your value plan ready for Tuesday. All right, Tuesday morning. Cool, have a good one. Great job.